Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Tina Sani, and today we're going to be talking about the five steps that you can do in five minutes that are really going to decrease your stress and also be able to get you back in a place of recentering. Right now, there's a lot of stress. We're all under a lot of pressure. There's a lot of uncertainty going on. And I wanted to bring you a video form of a, a cheat sheet, I guess you would call it, that I've created, which I'll leave in the um, description box below. You can go ahead and grab it so that you don't have to come back to this video. You can literally just have the paper form. Sorry for all the noise out there. My windows are open. It's a beautiful day. Um, but that's just how we're going to do it today, right? So, um, First things first, like this video, please, if you find some value in it, subscribe to my channel and also follow me on all my social medias. I'm on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok, all at Tina Sani, so you can find me there. I'll leave those links in the description box below as well, but let's get into the video. So, first step that I literally feel like no one can live without, like you have to do this step first and foremost, is take six long, deep breaths. You're gonna breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth, five seconds each. And you're gonna do that six times. That's gonna be one minute. What this is gonna do is it's going to take your mind off of whatever you're dealing with and it's actually gonna bring you back to center. It's gonna um, make you focus on something that normally is happening in your subconscious but you're bringing it to your conscious mind so that you can focus on it, so that you can um, kind of ignore all of the other things that are rolling through your brain. And it's going to help you to move forward into the, into the next five steps so you can really hone in on just getting your poop in a group, okay? Um, the second thing is take a minute to think of 10 things that you are grateful for, okay? The thing that we're missing a lot right now is the fact that we don't, we all we're seeing right now is like negativity on social media, negativity on the, on the media, on the news, and we're not really taking time to step back and think about all the incredible things that we already have, right? We have so much to be grateful for and taking 10 minutes, or I'm sorry, 10 or one minute to think of 10 things that can actually help you. Um, or are you're grateful for can actually help you to bring back a positive energy and bring back a positive mindset and think of all the things that you do have instead of the things that you don't. Um, step number three, make a mantra. This could literally be anything like I am strong. I am courageous. I know I can get through this. My faith is powerful. If you have a higher power, you can say I have faith in my higher power that, um, all things will be okay. Or, you know, I have faith in myself. If you don't have a higher power, you can say I have all, um, faith in myself that I will be able to get me or me and my family through this. Whatever helps you to feel better and empowers you, that's what you want. And the point of this is to give you, again, another segue into that positive thinking, the I'm going to handle my ish mode and really get back into what drives you and how you can be empowered in all the craziness today. Okay. Step number four, find a solution. So now you've taken your breaths. You have thought about the things that you're grateful for. You've also made a mantra. Okay. Now you're going to be like, okay, I'm in this positive headspace. What is the solution I can do right now? And the great thing about this is what it did, what all of these things did was they took you out of whatever traumatic or predicament that you were going through that was stressing you out. And it has given you a new way of thinking. You have closed off those negative pathways in your brain and you've now opened up a completely new way of thinking. You're using a different portion of your brain to come up with these things. So the best part about that is now you're going to be able to be solution based figuring out like maybe your kids are driving you crazy and you haven't thought of any craft ideas now you have some craft ideas that popped into your head because now you're on a positive wavelength your kids are going to see it you're going to see it the room is going to shift 
um, your family is going to receive what you're saying a lot better and you're going to be able to just control <laughs> those inner emotions where you feel like you just want to lash out at people or maybe you're just angry and you just you know maybe you're by yourself and you're just like I just need an outlet this will give you a way to be solution based so that you can figure out your um, whatever issue you're having in the current moment. And of course, step number five is go do the thing. You are a queen. You are seriously incredible. You got this. We are all going through stressful times and stressful situations. But you know what? The best part about this is we are not alone in this. You have me. You can always DM me on Instagram or Facebook. You can follow all my funny, weird videos on TikTok if that makes you feel better. Or you can comment down below and um, tell me what you're struggling with and I can kind of help you work through these steps. Also, like I said, in the description box will be um, my worksheet that gives you the five steps so that you can hang it up on your fridge, be reminded of it, maybe stick it in your phone for the times that you need it. And I really, really hope that you'll check out my other video that I posted yesterday on um, the incredible foods that will help boost your immunity and your mood and they no one is buying in the stores right now okay everybody bought out the toilet paper everybody bought out all the pasta and the bread and the milks but there are so many things still left in the store that i noticed nobody was even picking up and they're all really incredible superfoods so go check out that video and like subscribe if you liked this video let a girl know i will be so honored to do more of these videos and um, i hope this helped you to feel as beautiful as you already are love you guys and i'll see you later bye